you're listening to this, then it means you received my package. Unfortunately, this will be my last drop, as I've been forced into hiding. With the U.S. hostage situation, it's become unsafe to get anything out of Iran. You must get these to the press immediately. Many people's lives depend on it, including my own. If anything should happen to me, you must trust Bibi. I'm worried that our darkest days are still ahead of us. Do you remember what I said when I first joined the revolution? that it's better to die fighting for freedom than to live a prisoner. They found us! Baby, what's going on? Quick, grab the plants, we need to go now! Okay, okay, where is it?
You are a very lucky man, Master Shirazi. In my former life, I wouldn't have let you live. Drink. You must be thirsty. Reza, your chai is getting cold. Have it your way. This could be a very unpleasant place. Because here at Evin, we are correcting paths. You were one of us. We fought side by side to overthrow the Shah, that western puppet. What changed? Did we really fight for the same cause? When did you lose your faith? Instead of helping the new regime, you masterminded horrendous acts of violence against us. Are you ready for your redemption? I can save you, Reza. <laughs> there is nothing heroic in being silent, Reza Open it. Go on, open it. Or are you afraid to confront your past? Your photos rallied our nation to rebel against the Shah. But now... And they are being used to identify those who plot against our new Islamic government. Good, Aferin. Show me an act of good faith, and I will be fair. Reza Shirazi, you are charged with treason and conspiring to carry out a series of attacks against the Islamic Republic of Iran. How do you plead? Not guilty. Do you know what we do to traitors here in Evan prison? Torture them until they make a confession? <laughs> you must think of me. I know so much about you, Reza John. I know that you are coming from a very well-connected family who are loyal to the Shah. And I know about your Savak brother, Hussein. Leave my brother out of this. I know that upon your return from Germany, you joined our fight against the Shah despite your family's wishes. But what do you know about me? Do you know who I am? No, I don't. I see. My name is Asadullah Lajavardi. But you already knew that. Didn't you? Now, what is my name? Asadullah Lajavardi. Ah! <coughs> Why 
Why can't you show me the decency of remembering my name? My name is Asadullah Lajivardi. But here in heaven, they call me Hajar. Now, what is my name? Hajj Aga. Hajj Aga. See? That wasn't so difficult. Get up. Get up! Sit! Reza, the three men arrested with you have been executed. They confessed. They told us everything. We found your plans to bomb the Revolutionary Guards headquarters. I don't know of any plans. Look, I'm just a photographer. Do you know what this is? Of course you don't. A city boy like you has never had a use for a cattle prod until now. It takes about 400 milliamps to stop a human heart. We don't want that. Not yet. 25 milliamps? That burns you from the inside. We could damage an organ if I'm not careful. The next time I offer you a cup of tea, maybe you will think twice before. <laughs> Give us all the information about your collaborators and the details of your next target. Let's start with your friend, Bobak Azad. Who is he? Where can we find him? Is he the one who recruited you? Was he the mastermind behind the attacks in March? Reza, don't make me use this again. You could go to hell. Stop ah! talking! <laughs> Here you are, Babak Jan. Merci. To Fardo. Eh? Reza, what are you doing? Chikar me I know I'm good looking, <laughs> but save your film for something important. This is history in the making, Babak. Now, Bobo, now you're about to see history in the making. But I have plans for this picture back in Germany. Oh, yeah? That's nice of you, Reza Jan. Oh, not for me, it's for Hannah. Hannah? Hannah, Kia. Oh, you're gonna like her. She's got a thing for you, right? Oh, yeah, Vogan! <laughs> yeah, man. I've told her about you and your legendary disco moves. <laughs> John Travolta Bobo has nothing on me. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Here. In here. What's this? Listen to it, Reza. Gushko and Behesh. It's Khomeini's latest speech, and it just came from France. A new Iran is coming, Reza John, and I'm here to help spread the word. 
Oh, yeah? How did you get your hands on it? Oh, Bubba, you've been away too long. You forget. I have my ways. Bubba, what are you so worried about? They have eyes everywhere. And these cassettes have become the voice of the revolution and therefore a threat to the regime. Now take it, Bubba. Yeah. You know you want to. Uh, I, I don't know, Bubba. Bubba, have I ever steered you wrong? Are you forgetting about Lily? What? You like the Ramones, she liked the Ramones, it was a match made in heaven! Oh, but she looked like a Ramon. Okay, okay, you're right. Right? But seriously, you need to check this out. Come on, Reza, let's change Iran. It's not my kind of propaganda, Bobak. What you call propaganda, Reza, is my truth. It's just words, Bobak. Maybe to you, it's just words. But to me, it's words that have never been spoken out loud before. The time is now, Reza John. To know me, family, you know this. That's why you're here. My final offer, Reza. You ready to get educated? Well, shit. Okay, I'll give it a listen. Honey, that's all I ask, okay? But keep it hidden, and whatever you do, do not listen to it at home. I don't even want to imagine what your mother would do. <laughs> you're still scared of my mother, huh? <laughs> and you're not? Good point. <laughs> okay, Baba, be up. Let's get a better view. Bibi wants you to capture how big this is becoming. Who's Bibi? You're gonna like her. This is all because of her. See why I told you to save your film? This is incredible. This is the future of Iran. This is our future. Start taking pictures. I never thought I'd see the day the Shah statue would be trashed. like Khomeini, right? It's Shariat Madori, Grand Ayatollah. I've never seen anything like this. There has to be at least a hundred thousand people on the streets. Hey, can you read what that says, Reza? Some people call them martyrs. To me, they were victims. To some, those people praying would be intimidating. But to me, it's pretty powerful. Good luck trying to buy anything from the bazaar. All the shopkeepers have gone on strike too. But like seriously, I can't wait to get these developed. Did you get a picture of Ayatollah Shariat Madori? People are saying that he should lead Iran. I'm not sure if I did. He's a cleric who understands the hearts of the oppressed. No religious mullah is going to lead this country. Ahmadi, understand? That's over. Why not? Are we not a nation of Muslims, brother? Brother? Barudar? We are a nation of equality greater than Western capitalism or your paganism. Bifamidi, understand? No mullah will run this government. Bifami, Jimmy Gan? Hey, comrade. Lighten up. Chufti, you better back hey, away hey, before hey, I come hey, over. Okay? There. We don't do this, all right? This, all of this, is about non-violence. We don't want to give the army any reason to intervene. I don't trust this punk with his camera. 
Always posturing, never thinking about the bigger picture. Come on. Man, Bobak, what happened to you back there? Look, just because I didn't kick his ass doesn't mean I didn't want to. <laughs> Did you see his hair? You guys share the same barber? Comrade, that's all you got? Come on, let's hit the streets. This is not the Iran you left a year ago. The people are angry, especially after Savak burned down the cinema Rex. How do you know who's Savak, man? Come on, Bubba, everybody knows it's them. This is what they do. But now, people want answers. You think it can get out of control? Look, it could get ugly, but we won't achieve anything through violence. How are the people gonna take on an army? Look, Ezra John, you have to believe in the power of people, okay? Good will triumph. Now come on, it's time to discover what this revolution's all about. That's an interesting look. I've seen this guy before. He calls himself the Walking Dead. He's a walking memorial. Besaram, my son, please take a picture. Show the world what is happening here. Okay, Reza, just look at this street as a sandwich. <laughs> Are you okay, Bobby? Yeah, I'm great. Oh, Liam, it's the perfect analogy. With the perfect ingredients. The bread, the cheese, the siadouné, the sabzi, and the tea. The Iranian government says that the death toll from the terrorist attack on Cinema Rex and Abadan has officially reached 400. Radio Iran reports that the bodies of 377 people were recovered from the rubble. Two weeks ago, the cinema was filled with moviegoers when terrorists, who were positioned at all four corners of the theater, set it ablaze. The exit doors were locked, leaving the patrons unable to escape the building. Our BBC journalist in Tehran says that this is the biggest act of violence involving arson that Iran has ever seen. Another cinema in Shiraz was burned and a bomb explosion in a restaurant injured one person. A week before that, a total of three people were killed at a cinema in Mashhad. The Iranian government says that the death toll from the terrorist attack on Cinema Rex and Abadan has officially... As I was saying, Reza, the cheese, the panir, that's oh, what makes a sandwich a sandwich. And the cars we drive, the clothes we wear, the things we follow, that's what makes Iran, Iran. Mint, basil, tarragon, the students, writers, the revolutionaries. us the extra kick we need to set change in motion. We're one of the biggest exporters of oil in the world, and our people still have to stand in line to fill up their tanks. Tell me that isn't backwards. So is it peace you want or a fight? It might not be as poetic as Hafez or Rumi, but it gets the message across. Think about putting your slogan on the wall of martyrs.
That says it all. You can't trust the Americans. My father and my brother are rotting in jail. How many more must unjustly be imprisoned so that the Shah can live in his lavish palace and deny us our basic freedom? Here, brother, read the truth of what is really happening. Anything else you read is corrupt and filled with lies. Here you go, brother. Thank you, sister. Stay true, Here you go, sister. It's the only legitimate source to read now. That's the Zoroastrian symbol, Furuhan. In school they tell us it means royal power, but my mom always told me it stands for inner strength. تازه خوشمزه بربری تازه همه بیای بیا بیا بربری تازه نون خوش خوشی فرش این دلیشیز بربری هات فرام در آفن Who wants to read about the truth? Ignore the state sponsored newspapers, call the end of Anyways, the bitter Siaduna, the black seeds on top, are all the people left in the shadows by the Shah. The drug addicts, the beggars, the poor. The rich get richer and the poor get poorer. There's no chance for people like her in Iran today. Let the smoke of this Esfand protect you, my son. Inshallah. Merci, Khanum. I hope you and your child find what you need. Esfand, oh Esfand, People use the walls to post information in writing, too. At least before it gets torn down. Baby, Kurosh Aliye, huh? He's a real rock star. Yeah, yeah, Kurosh is good, but Darius is the man. Bah, bah, 
Gugush from this new album. Damish Gam. I love Gugush. Gugush is beautiful. See that stack of prayer cards? The guy who owns the stand is probably Christian. Hey, if Gugush and Adidas are good cheese, this guy getting mistreated because of his beliefs, that would be bad cheese. You're crazy, Bobby. Divune. As in Divune. Take a lesson. You see, I'm not the only one with these cassettes. I have something special for you. Look at all these cassettes. All the magazines are writing that when the reporters went to investigate the situation inside Iran, they witnessed Iran was a country whose population had started to march peacefully, numbering in many billions of people throughout the entire nation. Men, women and children, old and young, marched non-violently in the streets. They were all demanding that they didn't want this shock. So when the people don't want this public servant, he has to step aside. We don't want this public servant. He should step aside and we'll select a new leader ourselves. It's the people's right to say this public servant, this honest and decent man who wants to better our country to its highest heaven. We don't want him to be the one to do it. Don't they have that right? Isn't it a human right that every person has the right to determine his own destiny? Well, these people want to determine their own destiny, and they don't want this Mr. Public Servant. Let's get to the front before the crowd pushes us back. Cool, let's do it. This is gonna be great, Reza. One day we can tell our kids about this. No matter what, Paul, keep your eyes on me and let's not lose each other in the crowd. She doesn't hold back, huh? Because she says what we're all thinking. Join me in welcoming Brother Abbas, a personal hero of mine, and a man who has endured persecution and torture for his vision of a free Iran. I am honored to share this stage with you, and we are all humbled by your courage. Thank you, Miss Golestan. Represents a regime whose leader, Mohammad Reza Pahlavi, came to power illegitimately. Come on, Reza, join in. The deputies appointed by him. Reza, why are you not cheering? I, I don't know about this guy, Bob. Illegitimate. That's right. We the Iranian people. We must never, never forget what happened at the Cinema Rex by the hands of the secret police, the Savak. They trapped 425 innocent women, children, and men inside the cinema and burned it, burned it to the ground. Good proof, Damon. Pretty impressive, huh? I like what he's saying. Reza, you should be taking pictures of this. This is a momentous occasion. Man, look at all those people on the stage. Who are they? All the major players are represented. You got the clergy, the communists, the Tudor party, student leaders from the National Front, 
Even the Mujahideen is represented. All of them are here to support Abbas. It's dangerous for Abbas. That's what he needs to do. How long do you think a truce will last? I don't know. We'll see. Ah, still hiding behind the camera. Something's never changed. Ali! <laughs> Ali, what are you Benny doing Benny. here? Let me look at you. Wow. Ali? Oh, sure. I can't believe Ali, you're what here. are you doing here? Come on, man. in the military, you're everywhere. All right, get over here. Thanks for bringing this on. About time my cousin opened his eyes to the world. Ali, where you been? Kujai? I'm sorry it's been so long. I had to disappear for a bit. No one knows I'm back here, so let's keep it. Wait, are you no longer with the Mujahideen? What have you heard? Shishendi. Ali, what's going on? I did what I had to do. You do the same. Ali, you know this is a peaceful movement. Brother Abbas is preaching non-violence up there. How is that working out, Bobak, huh? Because I am for the side that wants to win. I see some of our friends have decided to join us. Hoshumadi, welcome. Let them arrest us. Let them beat us. Let them jail us. They are our brothers in wolves' clothing. This, this is, is a peaceful assembly. This is our democratic right. They've done nothing wrong. You cannot arrest him. Take your hands over. This way. Go. This is a disgrace, Reza. We're all supposed to be on the same side. We're all countrymen. This could get violent. Yes, it could. And that's exactly what they want. No options. No. Reza, you must take a picture of this. People need to see the truth. See? There's always a battle. Hey, Ali, what are you, you doing? Too. Come on, bro. Oh, this way. Get out of here. The soldiers aren't the enemy, Ali. They're oppressed workers. Don't you get that? They're forced to take orders by our oppressors. We're all the same in the eyes of this abusive government. What? Relax, Bobak. Ali knows what he's doing. Seriously, Bobak? Do you hear yourself? Nobody forced them to put on those uniforms. What choice do they have, Ali? They need their jobs. So we should pity them. Don't pity them. They're doing this to take care of their families. Family? What about my family? My father? Arrested, tortured, murdered, and for what? What choice did he have? If you're gonna cry about that, weep for him. When does it stop, Ali? When we make it stop. I fight for the innocence lost in that Evin prison. You worry about your damn soldiers. You win? Don't do this, Reza. Trust me. You throw that rock, and it's gonna change you. We can do this. Make a stand. Just drop it, Reza. Ali, what about what Abbas is saying up there about peace and prayer? Stick to your pictures, Reza. Why live in the real world when you can just take snapshots of it instead? Listen to him, Ali. Dorosmi. You made the right choice, Reza. What are a few rocks going to do other than justify the army to attack us? I, I don't know. It, but it was hard to hold back. They're taking Abbas. Final chance to redeem yourself. Do what Don't you listen want. to him, Reza. It's not the only way. I'll stick to taking pictures. You disappoint me, Reza. Death to the shore! <laughs> look! Look what Ali started! Come on! Let's get out of here!
Reza, Reza, over here. Oh, you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Where's Addy? I lost him. Take your pictures now before they tear gas the place. Show the world what's going on in our streets. If you ever get close enough to these rifles, you'll find three letters printed on them. U.S.A. Protesters, they're with the shop. Those soldiers just standing around, they look clueless. Brother Abbas! Ali! Oh my god! I got him, I got him! I, I got him! Easy. They really messed him up! Put him down, brother! Uh, oh, I need to get back oh, out there! Get it! Get, get it out! Oh, you? What? I have to get people! Reza! Take care of him! He's losing a lot of blood, Reza! Bye! Let's see where it's coming from! Okay, good! Hurry up! Oh, hold on! Oh my god! Look at all that glass! Take, take, take it yeah. out! I'll hold him down! You try to pull out as much as you can! I got this. I can do this. I got this. I got this. I got this. Hey. There is a piece in my stomach. I'll open the jacket. Under, under the jacket. Uh, uh. Bob, like, where did all this glass come from? From broken windshields. Uh, I gotta open up this jacket. Uh, 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 who did this? Uh, uh. <laughs> That's a lot of blood. <laughs> what? Listen to me. I've been betrayed. Uh, is that a handle? Sure Look, whatever it is, Reza, you need to do something about it. Okay, okay, let Where me the hell think. Is that? Where's BB? Somebody stabbed him. Uh, oh, Listen to me. I've been betrayed. Uh, Reza, you need to seal up the wound now. Reza took care of him. He's gonna be okay. Who is this? That's Reza. Abbas, you're safe. I don't know what we do with him. Abbas said he's been betrayed. Who's trying to kill Abbas? We need to get him out of here now. Who treated your wounds? Reza took care of him. Thank you, Reza. I don't know how to thank you. Help me get him up. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Abbas, I got you. Please, clear the area. We can't leave any traces of Abbas. They can't know he's been injured. Come on, Vivi! Reza, time's limited. We gotta go. This is what Abbas pulled out of his stomach. Reza, we're not going until you get everything. I'll take this hand for you, too. I don't know how we're gonna get home. I never thought today would turn out like this. This has gotta be Abbas's book. I hope Abbas makes it. These must be Abbas's glasses. Abbas is in good hands with Bibi and Ali. Abbas is wallet. You sure you got everything? Yeah, I think I got it all. <laughs>